So therefore, people, our, our brain is subconsciously wired like that. You know what I'm saying? It's alpha male, beta males. Even if you believe in that, you don't believe in that. At the end of the day, when we were cave, man, bro, you had an alpha male, the alpha male run the pack, and a beta male follows the alpha, right? Alpha males are usually the bigger guys, you feel me? The ones that can protect, you feel me? So our brain is hardwired to see shit that way. So if your body on point, it's still instinctively into us to look at the most in shape guy, the most physically impressive guy as the alpha male. So if you get your body on point, bro, you don't even have to say one word, bro. You're gonna already be perceived as the alpha. You're already gonna be perceived as masculine, you feel me? Man, what is up, YouTube family, man? Welcome back to my channel, bros. Hey, man, catch a vibe with your boy, you feel me? This is beautiful Louisiana weather, bro. This is beautiful, you feel me? I'm at LSU Lake, bro. It's just beautiful, man. It's fucking November, and it's like 85 degrees outside, you feel me? So anyway, like I say, catch a vibe, look at the scenery, and just enjoy life, bro. I need y'all boys to start getting outside and be active, bro, for real. Life is too beautiful for you to be cooped up, just for you to be cooped up on your computer and phone, you feel me? So anyway, one of my subscribers asked me a damn good question, feel me? He DM'd me on my Instagram. He was like, yo, Dominique, what do it takes to build up your masculine frame? I want to be more masculine. I want to have more masculine energy, you feel me? But look, before I get into this video topic, I need you to share this to your friends, you feel me? It's, for, it's so important for you and your whole team to get this knowledge, you feel me? I need you and your whole team to be alpha males, you feel me? Spread the fucking knowledge, bro. We have way too many beta males in this world, you feel me? So anyway, oh, and by the way, I have my Instagram link in the description box below. So if you have a question for me, just shoot me a DM, you feel me? So anyway, let's go on here and get into this video topic, you feel me? So check this out. What you need to do to build up your masculine energy and your masculine frame is this, bro. I need you to have ambition and goals in life, you feel me? The reason why you don't have no masculine energy is because you don't, you're not working towards anything. As a man, we're literally designed to create, you feel me? We are creators, you feel me? We literally created this world. I'm not being sexist or anything, but we really created this world, you feel me? You need to start using your head, you need to find your purpose in life, and you need to start chasing success, you feel me? That what builds masculine energy, you feel me? Masculine energy is getting shit done. Masculine energy is confidence, you feel me? What comes with confidence? Your purpose. And why you need to have purpose in life? Because it fuels your confidence, you feel me? It goes hand in hand. So to build your masculine energy, bro, I need you to set goals and ambition in life, you feel me? And just start chasing something, you know what I'm saying? Start chasing success, you feel me? That is masculine energy. Another step to masculine energy is this. This is the most important step in my opinion, you feel me? So what you need to do is this right here. I need you to have self-respect for yourself, you feel me? It's so important for you to have self-respect for yourself, bro. Nobody know how to stand up for themselves anymore in this generation, you feel me? That's like the lost art of our generation, you feel me? So what I mean by standing up for yourself is this, bro. I'm not saying like go around beating up everybody, you feel me? But what I do need you to do is this, bro. I need you to start setting boundaries. I need you to start setting limitations to how far you let somebody use you, you feel me? So what I mean by that, bro? Don't let nobody disrespect your principle, you feel me? You was born by yourself, you're gonna die by yourself, you feel me? So what I need you to do, bro, stand on all 10 by yourself, you feel me? Stand on all 10, bro. Set out your boundaries, set out your principles. Don't let nobody disrespect that, you feel me? I need you to be a true man, bro. I need you to stand up for yourself and just start having self-respect, bro. That is the main key to being masculine, you feel me? Another key point to being masculine is this, bro. You have to start being comfortable in uncomfortable situations. You gotta get out your head and you just gotta change your mind frame or stuff, bro. I need you to start taking charge of situations. I need you to start being a leader of situations. That is masculine energy, bro. I need you to start taking charge, bro. Even if you're an introvert, get out your comfort zone, get out your shell, and just start taking charge, bro. Yes, it's gonna be awkward as fuck your first couple of times doing it, but you're gonna feel so good when you do it, bro. I promise you. So get out your shell and start taking charge of situations, you feel me? It, I mean, it's life, bro. You got one life. Live it to the fullest. Live all your experiences from the goods and the bad, bro. That is masculine energy, bro, because you're going to start learning how to be comfortable in uncomfortable situations, you feel me? The next thing that you need to do to build up your masculine energy is hit the gym, bro. It is so important for you to get your body on point. The reason being, bro, that's like, if you get your body on point, that's like 85% of the battle, bro. Check this out. Just hit me out on this shit right here. If you get your body on point, you can walk in a room full of people, right? And if your body's on point, bro, you don't even have to say one word. People are already gonna assume that you are alpha male. People are already gonna feel that masculine energy radiating off your body because we already, our brain is subconsciously telling us, okay, if you have a nice body, you're disciplined. 
And what discipline is? Masculinity, you feel me? You're disciplined to hitting the gym every day. You're disciplined to not putting bullshit in your body. So therefore, people, our, our brain is subconsciously wired like that. You know what I'm saying? It's alpha male, beta males. Even if you believe in that, you don't believe in that. At the end of the day, when we were cavemen, bro, you had an alpha male, the alpha male run the pack, and a beta male follows the alpha, right? Alpha males are usually the bigger guys, you feel me? The ones that can protect, you feel me? So our brain is hardwired to see shit that way. So if your body on point, it's still instinctively into us to look at the most in shape guy, the most physically impressive guy as the alpha male. So if you get your body on point, bro, you don't even have to say one word, bro. You're gonna already be perceived as the alpha. You're already gonna be perceived as masculine, you feel me? So, I hope all this digesting your head, bro. Another point to building your masculinity is this, bro. Be true to yourself with no influences. Let me say that again, bro, because we live in a copycat generation. Be true to yourself with no influences, you feel me? Like, we, 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 we tend to like let other people dictate our lives, bro. That's the most beta thing that you could do, bro. Masculinity is standing alone and being by yourself, even if other people are doing everything else. If everybody else want to go that way, but you feel like that's not the right way to go, and you want to do this shit over here, that is masculine energy. Be, have the ability to stand on all ten by yourself and be alone. You feel me? That is masculine energy. Your emotions not dictated by other people. You know how to control your emotions. You know how to be alone. You don't mind being alone. That is masculine energy, bro. Masculine energy is just pretty much, long story short, being true to yourself and just having self-respect and standing on your guidelines and don't deviate from that shit you feel me? masculine energy is a it's just a fucking resolving revolving cycle of you just constantly self-improving on yourself and self-developing yourself to be the best version of yourself because masculine energy and confidence they go hand in hand you feel me the more the more that you self-improve the more confidence that you have and your confidence emulates your masculine energy if that making sense to you you feel me so let me recap all this for you you feel me you need to get your body on point. You need to stop caring about what other people think. And just self-develop on yourself every single day, bro. And just stay, you know what I'm saying? Just stay, be true to yourself at the end of the day, bro. Be firm. When you talk, take charge of the situation. Get out your comfort zone. I just need you to start taking charge. And just be a true leader, bro. That is masculine energy, you feel me? I need you to stop being shy and just start taking charge of situations, bro. We live in a world filled with beta males. So when you start learning how to take charge, bro, your confidence is going to get sky high because you're going to really realize we're surrounded by betas, bro. And you shouldn't have been holding yourself back in the first place, you feel me? And that was a damn good question, you feel me? So look, if you have any more questions for me, leave it in the comment section below or shoot me a DM on my Instagram, you feel me? So with that being said, man, leave this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel.